These days, East Grand Rapids is known as a neighborhood of gorgeous homes and boutique shops, all leading down Wealthy Street to the scenic Reeds Lake. Now rewind about 140 years. You'd see a massive roller coaster ripping down that same stretch, comedy shows on the lawn, hot air balloons floating over the water, and steamboats crashing into the docks. East Grand Rapids was a tourism mecca from 1881 to 1954. A boom happened when Grand Rapids Railway Company bought the 21 acres at the end of their line. Much like Coney Island, the railway company enticed visitors to buy a ticket on their new public transportation and get free admission to an amusement park and beach in return. In 1914, the Jack Rabbit Derby Racer entered the scene. The dual track let riders race each other as they whipped around the track, and then one big drop. Thrill seekers plummeted 85 feet, making the ride a fan favorite. Meanwhile, on the lake, visitors congregated at a bathing beach where they could rent the latest fashion, wool bathing suits. To cool off, a large water slide was built where riders could slide down in a wooden toboggan. At the docks, steamboat captains would duel to get tourists aboard. At 10 cents a trip, riders could circle the lake, enjoy lunch, and hear some music. Four major steamships took over the lake. The Florence, Hazel A, Major A.B. Watson, and the Ramona dominated from 1880s to the 1950s. In 1954, East Grand Rapids voters opted to redevelop the land for housing and retail instead.